Hi everyone, it's Lacey. I received a request for a office attire, office appropriate stretching video for anybody who's spending a lot of time sitting. This is perfect for you. It's nice and short. You can do it during your break. Um, I am wearing what I have for office attire. I'm not an office worker, so I don't really have much, um, but I did want to consider range of motion for you. Everything is standing. Um, I do use a chair, but you can also use a desk in place or even a wall. You can use that in place as well. I hope you enjoy this video. And if you have any comments that I think are a good idea, I will absolutely make a video for you. All right, that's it. Let's do it. Start by getting as office scandalous as you possibly can. So untuck your shirt, undo your collar, take your shoes off. And we're just going to start rolling our neck from side to side. Stretch your neck over to the right, gently pulling your head down with your right hand. Now twist your neck to look down and pull on your head from the back. Now we're going to do the other side, so pulling your left ear to your left shoulder to stretch your neck. Twist your neck and look down. Alright, come to standing with your legs together and we're just going to roll down and up. So from your head, rolling all the way down with straight legs and roll back up and do this a few times. On the way up, your head is last. On the way down, your head is first. Try to move the entire length of your spine. Stay down on this one and we're going to bend and straighten our knees. So bend and straighten, bend and straighten. Just keep going at your own pace, trying to get a little deeper every time you straighten your legs. Now separate your legs a little bit wider than hip distance apart. Grab opposite elbows and sway side to side. Put your feet back together and roll back up. Adjust yourself as needed. And we're going to start using that chair now. So put your hands on the back of the chair. Your hips 
or your feet, sorry, about hips distance apart again. We're going to do some mini cat and cows here. So a little arch and a little arch the opposite way. Now when you come back down into your cow arch, I want you to hold it and go as far down as you can. So you're trying to sink your head between your shoulders here. This is all about the shoulders. and come on up. Again, making any adjustments you need. Let's roll our shoulders back. And forward. Now holding onto the chair, cross your left leg over your right and your right arm is going to go up and over in a side body stretch. I'm just going to turn around to do the opposite. So you're going to cross your right leg over your left, and I did it wrong, um, but you should do it right, and then your left arm is going to go over. Turn and face the chair, and you're going to clasp your hands together and rest your elbows on the top of the chair. Walk your feet out as far as necessary, and try to push your head down between your shoulders. All right, come out of that. That was a little intense, so let's roll our shoulders back once again. (laughs) 
change and roll them forward. Grab a hold of the back of your chair and pedal out your legs. So one bent, one straightened. Gonna get into our calves here. Take your right leg forward and start rolling out your ankle. Go one way and then switch and go the other way. And do the other leg, rolling out your ankle one way and then roll it the other way. We're going to stretch our right leg back and bend our left knee. Have your foot flat. I know you can't see mine, but have it flat on the ground. You're stretching your calf muscle here. Now you're going to swing that back leg up and over your chair or your desk or you're just going to plant it on the wall in front of you if that's where you are. Wiggle your back foot out as far as you need to. I was definitely way too close. And you're going to lean forward and come up, lean forward and come up, lean forward, come back up. Lean forward, back up, lean forward, and hold it. Come out of that and stretch your left leg back. So right knee bent, left foot flat, so you're getting a calf stretch. And get your left foot on the back of the chair, however you'd like to. We're going to lean forward and up, lean forward, come back up, lean forward, come back up, and lean forward, come back up, lean forward, and hold it. You can get out of that now and come into any comfortable standing position.
from here, we're just going to clasp our hands together and push them out forward. And now you are going to round your back and look down. Keep your hands as they are, but stretch your arms up and over your head. Again, keeping your hands this way, we're going to start bending from side to side. Just go as far as you can go. Definitely be gentle here. Unclasp your hands and reclasp them behind your back. You can either stretch your knuckles down toward the floor or if you want a deeper stretch, you can start lifting your arms out from your back. All right, come out of that. We're just gonna do some upper body twists from side to side. Just gently swaying. You can do some shoulder rolls again with a swing incorporated, so back and swing, forward, swing, back, swing. You get the idea, get nice and loose. Stretch your right arm across your chest and just do some bounces, I guess you would call these. I don't really know. Just gently pulling for more of a motion stretch than a static one, and move on to the other side. Testing our balance on this first twist, we're gonna lift our right knee and cross it over our body, and we're gonna look to the opposite wall. Now for the left side, you get to cheat a little, so you can hold on to the back of your chair, lift up that left knee, cross it over your body, and twist your upper body so that you're facing the opposite wall. That's it. I hope you feel great in both mind and body. If you work in an office, I recommend you do this every day if you can, or something similar to it. Please like and subscribe uh, to support me. Thank you so much. Have a great day.